Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to answer one of the Selenium interview questions. That is, what are the different types of Selenium commands? Let me answer. All the commands in Selenium IDE tool are known as Selenium commands. And these commands can be categorized into different types. They are actions, accessors, and assertions. These are the three types of Selenium commands we have. First type, actions. Okay, what are these actions commands? The commands in Selenium ID tool which manipulate the state of the application are known as actions commands. Okay, examples for these commands are which manipulate the state of the application, such kind of commands like click. Okay, on clicking an element, the state of the application will be manipulated. Similarly, we have type, okay, which can be used for uh, typing text into the fields and all. Open for opening the application, you are in the browser, closing the application, closing the browser itself. Okay. So all these are the type of the commands in Selenium ID tool, which can be used for manipulating the state of the application. And this category of the Selenium commands are known as actions. Next category of the Selenium commands are accessors. Okay. So which can be used for evaluating the state of the application. Okay. And storing the results into the variables. Okay. Such kind of commands are called as accessors. If you can see these examples, you will understand how these commands are going to store the results into the variables and uh, they are called as accessors kind of commands. First one, store title, okay, which will, you know, retrieve the title and uh, uh, whatever the retrieved title is there, that will be stored into this store title, okay. Then store text, the results, uh, the result is nothing but title of the page that will be stored into the variable, okay. The result will be the text that will be stored into the variable. The result will be the value that will be stored into the variable. Such kind of commands, store, store, store kind of commands are known as, which fall, are, fall, will fall into the accessors category of this Selenium commands. Next type of commands we have are the last step, that is assertions, okay. The, is to verify the state of the application, okay. Final check, verification. Based on these commands only, the test will either pass or fail. Such kind of commands are called as assertions kind of commands, okay. In Selenium commands, the third category is assertions, which verify the state of the application. Examples, before I give you the examples, this assertion commands, Assertions commands can be further categorized into three modes. Okay. There are three types of assertion commands that is verify, assert, and wait for. Coming to the first set, verify. Example, one of the example is verify alert. Okay. Which, which verifies whether the alert is displayed on the page or not. Second, assert alert. This also will verify whether the alert is displayed on the page or not. This is like, you know, both can be used for verification, but uh, the assert will, this is hard assert kind of thing. This is a soft assert kind of thing. Okay. Hard assert means if a particular step containing this assert statement fails, uh, the execution will stop there itself. And if there is another code in the test, that will not run. Whereas verify the soft assertion. If even though this particular statement having this command fails also, remaining steps after this statement will also run. Okay. That's the only difference between verify and assert. Okay. So either you can use verify, uh, verify alert. Uh, if you want to go with a software, like uh, even though this particular step having this command fails, Still, if you want to continue the execution of the remaining steps or lines of code in the Selenium ID tool, you can go with this verify kind of commands. Verify alert is one of the examples. There are a lot of other stuff, uh, other verify commands in Selenium ID. Assert, hard assertion. If it fails, remaining steps after this statement containing this command are going are not going to get executed. Okay, it's kind of hard assert. The execution will stop there itself. Okay, so both are verification only, but uh, you know the soft and uh, soft and hard. Only that there is a difference. And the last one is a wait for, okay? All the waiting for kind of commands also fall into the assertions category in the Selenium C commands. Wait for alert, okay? Waiting mechanism kind of thing. You are waiting for an alert to be displayed. Till then you are not going to do anything kind of stuff, okay? After the alert gets displayed within the time, right? Waiting will be done and you will go to the next step kind of thing, okay? So this kind of verify assert and wait for fall into the assertions category of Selenium C commands. So hope guys you understood what are the different types of Selenium C commands. Uh, Okay, all these commands belong to the Selenium ID tool and can be categorized into these three categories. And uh, you also got the examples in this session. So that's all for this session. Thank you. Bye-bye.